What's up, everybody? It's your boy Spare Mask coming at y'all again with another video. And yeah, man, we on Nuketown, man. We on Nuketown. And I gotta be honest right off the bat, you know, I gotta be honest. The only reason I even jumped into this game is to get this footage so that I can make this video, man. Because I'm gonna be honest with you, man. I'm just I'm tired of Nuketown. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of the same old stuff, but we're not going to go there first. You know, we, we'll let's start off with the positive, man. We'll start off with the positive today, and then we'll get into the good stuff. Man, the map looks good. It looks good. It really does. Um, I mean, it, it plays. I, I personally think it plays too fast, and I think, you know, they need to. I think a limited sprint should just be. We need to take that back out of the game. That's just my opinion. My opinion. But this map looks good overall and it plays the way it's always played spawn trap like i'm doing right now you know catch people coming out the spine you know hold down the middle a little bit you know and just sit there and catch people coming out the spines that's that's pretty much all nuketown really is um but i mean it's non-stop action and people love it and people love it man um now that's about all the good stuff i have to say about it <laughs> that's all the good stuff i have to say and we're gonna we're gonna let, let's get into the bad stuff man let's get into the bad stuff first off activision man why did you why, why did y'all come out with this game with this map two weeks after the game launches man like this is your like bread and butter this is your go-to map you know what i'm saying like this is your legendary map and you come out with it two weeks after how, like what else are we supposed to what else are we supposed to do after a year goes by? You know what I'm saying? Like, you should have came out with this map six months down the road, you know, to alleviate, you know, all the nuances of this game, period. You know, like, all right, like, we're all tired of the game, skill-based matchmaking, yada, yada, yada. Six months down the road, I think I'll log back in and play a little bit of Nuketown and then be done, you know? I, I think it would have prolonged the longevity of the game. I think this is going to make the game die fast. That's just my opinion. I could be wrong. If you think this will make the you know if you think this will make the game die fast hey man let me know put it down in the comments man let's hear it. let's hear y'all let's hear let's hear your thoughts man like i want to know man there, you know i think on my last video somebody hit that dislike button and that's cool you know whatever but if you're gonna hit that dislike button i mean let let us know let us know what's up let us know you know what's wrong what what you disagree with you know i want to know because i'm here to learn you know that's why i created this channel is to is to learn and get people like me you know voice like I'm just a regular dude. You know, I still go to work and I just get off work and play a couple of games, man. That's it. That's all I do, man. And I've been buying COD for 10 years minus the space jumping. You know what I'm saying? So I've got a lot of money invested in this game, man. And I want to see this game do well. But if this game dies, I won't be disappointed at all. I just won't be because I feel like this was just lazy. This was a lazy. This was a lazy attempt at making a good multiplayer, man. And we spent 60 bucks for a, for a not all the way done game and us as call of duty gamers we got like we gotta stop doing that man we gotta stop doing that we keep buying the same stuff over and over again that's why hey you know they just throw us nuketown and we're just okay yeah, yeah we'll, we'll throw nuketown and they'll be okay they'll be good you know they'll be good you know are we that simple man are we really that simple huh are we really that simple man that we just uh, they throw us nuketown and all of a sudden we just oh man yeah man nuketown's legit you know, and this game just, this game just don't do it for me, man. This game, and I'll tell you what, man, I, I jumped on Black Ops 1 last night, man, and I had, I had so much fun, man. I had a lot of fun playing Black Ops 1, man. I jumped in there about midnight. I didn't get off that game to like 12.30 this morning, or no, about 3.30. 3.30 this morning, I didn't get off that game. I played about four hours of Black Ops 1 last night on PlayStation 3 with some broken controllers. We're broken controllers, man. With some broken controllers. This that's how that's just how fun that game was. And I'm gonna put that gameplay somewhere up here. Like I I will uh put a link, you know, over you know up top or whatever or down low, somewhere like that, so you can see it because it's fun, man. And just just look at how the game plays. Like Black Ops 1 played so well compared to this. It played so well, you know, and you know, I had a lot of fun doing it, man. I think my kids sat there and watched me play it for two hours, and they went to sleep. But I kept playing, man. It was it was fun, and I played it. I played it on my old TV. <laughs> I was playing on the LCD TV, Black Ops One, and I had a lot of fun, man. No headphones, no nothing, and it was fun. But, 
you know, the direction that COD is going now, man, is just, I, I just don't know if I can participate in all this stuff, man. I just don't know why, if I can keep this going, man. Because I play an hour of this game, and I just, I, I'm, I'm ready to go, I don't know. I'm ready to go lift some weights or something. <laughs> like, I don't know, man. This game, like, really gets to me, man. I'm tired of it. You do good one time, and then rest of that is just mediocre games, man. It's all mediocre, man. I know there's... There can't be that many people out there feel like they're actually doing something. And if they are, they never experienced what low-level skill-based matchmaking was. Because I think there was skill-based match, skill matchmaking in the older CODs. It just wasn't turned up to the max the way it is now. It's turned all the way up now. But, um, but yeah, man, I just I just wish we could get different maps. You know, there's some there's some pretty decent maps on Black Ops Black Ops One that they could have they could have redid and gave to us off the bat. They would have been better off giving us Summit or something right now. But you you leave you, Nuke Town is the icing on the cake, man. It's the icing on the cake. You know, release at least eighty percent of your DLC and then give us Nuke Town, man. That's how you give us Nuke Town. That's how you do it. Not when everybody's upset because we just gonna we're gonna trash it. We're gonna trash it. Is is good as this map looks. We're gonna trash it. But you know, it doesn't play like it used to. It doesn't play like it used to. Yeah, we're going to get out here and get chopper gunners out here. That's what we're going to do out here, man. And these, man, the kill, I didn't even address the kill streaks, man. The kill streaks in this game, man, you, you can only use them half the time. It's like when the, you know, when you're on a map with a bunch, like Miami, if you're on that map, it's because it's got a lot of buildings. If you get a chopper gunner, it's like useless, man. And then the spawn protection, bro. Oh my goodness, man the spawn protection man it's like that's all activision is doing out here is they just trying to protect the trash players in this game man and i'm not trying to sit here and be like i'm the best yeah get that out get that out get that out of there bro not about to shoot us with that and i'm not trying to sit here and say that i'm the best player man i can hold my own i'm not like the greatest player i'm just a casual call of duty player man that's it but you know we got we got to stop catering to this stuff man and if you got any suggestions about what we should do about the skill based matchmaking and this lazy attempt to give us new maps you know to give us new content man to give us better content than the old man like the, the creativity in uh and all these creators man is just it's, it's low man it's low they can't give us nothing new they give us the same old stuff every year and they need to give us something new man we need to get something new so if you got a suggestion about what we should do man put it down in the comments i want to hear it i want to hear it but anyway man uh, let me go ahead and get out of here i'll catch y'all on the next video don't forget to like my stuff like my stuff share this video subscribe if you haven't already i'm out